My beloved child, let go now of those worries that haunt you, the anxieties that weigh heavily on your heart. You sacrifice peace when you constantly churn them in your thoughts, burdening yourself with worry as you contemplate the future. Instead of enduring those restless nights, hand over your concerns to me and allow yourself the peace to sleep soundly. Release now everything that holds you back and have faith. My purpose is to instill peace in your existence. Recognize the value you possess in my sight. You are not an accident, but a being with a unique and important purpose in this vast universe. Your potential is immense, and when you fully embrace it, you will ascend and become a source of blessings for many. This is precisely why distractions stand at your doorstep, eagerly wanting to enter. Should you let them in, they swiftly take over your thoughts, drumming up a cacophony of noise, stress, and confusion within you. I assure you, this is the truth. It holds, regardless of your origins, your family background, the shadows of your past, or the depths of pain you've experienced. You've entrusted your life to me, and now, above all, I wipe away your past, heal your wounds, clear your vision, and unveil a future filled with blessings. I will grow your wisdom, boost your intelligence, and give you both courage and caution. You'll learn to control your words. I'll ease your worries and teach you patience. The transformation has already begun, preparing you to take the first step and walk joyfully towards the promise of a new life. Leave behind the past and the dreams that have drifted away now focus on a fresh path leading to divine blessings. I talk about a future rich with prosperity and holiness, but you drown out my words with your worries lying awake at night. Listen closely now. This isn't a game. Having faith and trusting in me isn't about pretending to be all right while suffering inside. I don't want you leading a double life where outwardly you appear happy blessing others, but inside, when you're alone, fear overtakes you, haunted by past spiritual battles that knocked you down. You smile and shed tears at the same time, but hear me closely, don't ignore the guidance I'm sharing with you. Once more, understand that faith isn't about a flawless existence or evading challenges. It's about clinging to my promises even when times get tough knowing you're capable of facing any challenge, aware of who's by your side. Stand resilient in the midst of turmoil, confidently bringing your worries to me, admitting when you're overwhelmed, seeking the vigor to press on. Embracing faith means you've handed your life over to me, waiting with assurance for the blessings I've assured, secure in the knowledge that you and your loved ones are safeguarded by my might no matter where you find yourselves. My presence envelops you. My forces champion your cause, shielding you from unseen perils. Faith is about getting up, dusting yourself off, and advancing, pursuing the dreams and goals I've set before you. In spite of your frailties, your missteps, and your history, therefore I implore you, listen to these words once more. I want you to remember them well and etch them into your heart. By nightfall, may you sleep peacefully and without concern. I want you to read aloud Psalm 23 again and again. Pronounce it letter by letter, word by word. Feel how, as you say, the Lord is my shepherd, your entire being envelops in divine peace and your heart grows calm. Now close your eyes and express gratitude for your life for your family. Be thankful for the love I extend to you today. I'm speaking directly to you, urging you, entrust your life to me, your struggles, your heavy loads. I no longer wish for you to be bound by those deceitful feelings that sap your spirit. Don't be shackled by anxiety. Learn to rely on this Heavenly Father who holds you dear and always wants the best for you. Do you trust me? Please let me know. 
as you do, feel my love enveloping you. Get ready, for I'm about to open the door you've been fervently praying at. I'm aware of your imperfections, your faults, and frailties. Yet what's important to me at this moment is your faith, the flicker that keeps you going, praying, knocking, sometimes even with a loud cry. For you know, to the one who persistently knocks, the door will swing open. To the one who calls, a response will be given. To the one who earnestly asks, it will be provided. Your faith delights and fills me with joy. I look forward to bringing a smile to your face when you discover that in my heavenly realm, your name is well known. For you are celebrated as a beacon of steadfastness, endurance, determination, bravery, and faithfulness. In the days ahead, I plan to show you, just as I do every day, you know this well. But now I want you to feel my presence even closer. I want you to see for yourself that your Heavenly Father is real, all-powerful, and supreme. Your life and your family's future are in my hands. Just as you've trusted me until now, I want you to continue on your journey, sometimes walking, sometimes running, but always with pride and without stumbling. Keep going, champion. There's still much for you to achieve. You're meant to reach your goal, victorious, in my sacred name. With one hand, you shall receive the blessings I bestow upon you, and with the other, you shall offer aid to those in need. In their hearts, I bless you. As you assist others, I shall prosper you. Extend your hand first to your family, then to all who sincerely seek your help along your path. Fear not, you shall lack nothing. You won't have to face poverty anymore. Leave the hardships of the past behind. All your needs, sorrows, and frustrations are now just history. No one will take away what's yours, but remember to keep up the honesty and faithfulness that have always guided you. You're not meant to deceive or betray. Leave such lowly behaviors to those who lie and cheat. Let them go their own way. I'm with you through everything. I won't leave you or get upset when you falter and get a little dirty from the world's mess. I know you'll get back up. You've been loyal for so long. And if I see your faith starting to slip, I'll reach out and lift you up again. I am your true guide. Unlike those false leaders who offer help only in your worst times and then abandon you when you're down. I'm not like people who might deceive. I have no reason to lie. My words to you are direct, and sometimes they may be hard to hear, but it's because I'll always give you the truth. I hope you understand and do not become like those confused souls who seek only to scratch the itch in their ears, desiring to hear only sweet words. Know that I speak to you with affection and want you to feel well, but at times like today, I shall speak directly to your heart for I wish to see you prospering and abundant, not pursuing false doctrines born of perverse imagination. I have bestowed upon you the sword of my truth. Arise and fight. I have anointed you with my Holy Spirit. None shall stand against you all the days of your life. Just as I was with my servants in the past, so shall I be with you, for I have chosen you for this time to serve me. I have raised you up. Do not pursue fame or money, for I am your provider. You don't need to tell untruths or embellish stories to be seen. You don't have to use deception to make your way. Tell me, do you love me with your whole heart? And will you trust in me as you've done before? I'm letting you know. Get ready for the extraordinary things I'm about to do in your life. Miracles that will amaze you. Yet, with these blessings comes responsibility. Expect some to be jealous and to question your success, dismissing it as mere luck, but don't let their skepticism shake you. Remember this message. The door you've been persistently knocking on is about to swing wide open. Get ready to step into a realm beyond the ordinary. Don't be afraid, be brave. Don't be discouraged by others' deceit or hostility. Hold firm to your faith, and I will elevate you above those who oppose you. They will end up 
disgraced. While you will walk with me into lush meadows, where I will guide you beside streams of refreshing water, I will watch over you carefully, because I cherish you. Give me your hand. I'm here to pull you from your anguish. You might have thought there was no escape, that it was the end. But I assure you, my child, this marks the start of a remarkable transformation in your life. Give me your hand now, and I shall deliver you from all the conflicts that surround you. Today, I must tell you that this is the end of many negative things that have been happening to you. All these things that sadden and hurt you shall cease. The time has come for you to leave behind these people and situations that lead you into a bottomless pit. It is time to distance yourself and release all the sadness that false friendships have buried in your soul. Rid yourself of that guilt, those memories that stab at you, and all those things that make your heart weep. I shall heal you, I shall help you. Forget these terrible things. They shall not happen again. But release these burdens. You do not need them. If you release these burdens, you won't have to suffer anymore because I'm holding you close. And I won't let you carry this heavy load by yourself any longer. It's been too long. It's not your fault what happened. These issues aren't yours to fix. My child, please stop holding on to these concerns. I yearn to see you joyful and thriving, as these worries don't serve your health or happiness. Today, I'm offering you a fresh start, new hope, a path filled with happiness. I assure you, my child, things will be different. I will heal your aching heart and look after you with immense affection. I'm granting you the strength to start over. I'm opening up a vast door to amazing possibilities, far greater than any you've lost. Don't be scared. Grasp my hand and stand up. Let go of the past, because it's time for your triumph. I've laid out incredible blessings for you. I am your God, and I know precisely what you need. That's why I'm personally taking charge to resolve every issue. Your time of deliverance is here. In this new day, I will surprise you. I will bring you new news. You're about to receive the answer you've been waiting for. Today, I will change your life. I do it because I have seen your suffering, your faith, and your surrender. The miracle you are about to receive will bring great joy to your heart. You thought it was impossible for it to happen. But listen to my voice at this moment and prepare to receive your blessing. Open your hands, empty your heart of feelings of doubt and distrust, because what comes into your life today is much bigger and better than you had thought. I've seen you praying daily, asking for an opportunity to be revealed, and today I'm here to say that door has indeed swung open. Everything you've hoped for from me is about to become a reality. Do you trust in this power? Are you ready to embrace my blessing? Hold on to your faith and courage. Accept what I offer you with open arms. Don't turn away from what I place before you, even if your challenges seem insurmountable, even if the fight feels never-ending, even if things don't always go as planned. I am your God, overseeing every aspect of your life and every circumstance. Stand firm in your faith, Gaze upwards and always keep your head high, because I do not deceive. I never fail. I don't lose battles. And I will never leave you. Feel the peace I'm sending you right now, filling your heart with calm. In this peace, find trust and rest, allowing it to inspire bravery within you and rekindle your dreams. It will enable you to believe in love once more, to forgive those who've wronged you, and grant you the wisdom to decide who deserves another chance. It will also give you the strength to refuse and walk away from harmful relationships or toxic friendships. Maybe because of everything you have been through, you are not used to living surrounded by peace and happiness. You were so troubled that you couldn't enjoy my blessings, but be brave and do not faint. Accept this new life. Your spirit has been reborn. 
Your feet will walk a new path. The future that is coming to you is great and wonderful, but you have to believe it and accept it. Tell me with your own lips, I believe it and I receive it. You have been tested. Now it's time for you to be blessed. You have suffered enough and have learned so many good lessons from everything you have lived. You were so brave facing afflictions that you did not expect. It was not because of your mistakes. It was not you who caused them. The enemy wanted to shake you like the wind shakes the wheat. In your moments of despair, you scattered your seeds and they touched the earth, moistened by the tears you cried in your suffering. Yet, look now with eyes of faith. The ground stirs and fresh sprouts emerge, visible to you. Let it be known deep within your heart that this year you shall witness a bountiful harvest. The seeds you presumed lost have sprung to life, soon to bless you with abundant fruits, bounties that enrich your soul without bringing sorrow or burdens in their wake. I've positioned you precisely where you're meant to flourish, under my care as your shepherd, assured that your sustenance is from me. Treat others kindly, yet reserve your complete trust for no mere person. Follow my teachings, let go of doubt and negativity, and stand firm in faith. With such belief, marvels and miracles are not just possible, they're assured. Your faith makes them real. But it is not a game, this is not luck or magic or empty declarations. I'm talking about my holy word, the one that always fulfills in the perfect time according to my will. You want to change, you want things to go well, you desire to prosper, so that your family lacks nothing, so that everyone seeks compassion and that wisdom and truth exist in their lives. You desire a transformation with all your heart. I want and I can transform you. I have the power, I can change hearts and thoughts from night to morning and I will do it. But I always need your faith. You are entering a new land that you will soon see. Leave what is behind and reach forward your hand with faith. Hold on to the blessing that I will put before you. The test is passed. Your time has come. Today I'm going to work wonders in your life and your family's lives, so don't fret over the door that's just shut. Talk to me. Say it out loud. Solidify your thoughts. Write it down now. Tell me you trust in me that you welcome this word of solace, and that you embrace this divine boost sent straight from heaven. Just because one door has closed doesn't mean you should lose hope. A bigger door is about to swing open, bringing with it something far greater. There's a battle in the spiritual heavens over your life and your faith. You have adversaries aiming to hinder your progress, launching attacks from the outside and wounding you from within, even though they remain unseen. I will guide individuals endowed with heavenly wisdom into your life to support your breakthrough. Welcome their guidance with humility. Invest time in prayer, and I will disclose even more to you. You are going to overcome this fight. Every hurdle in your path will be demolished. It's true that I can deliver you in a second, but I need you to value your faith, your talent, and your gifts to learn that victories are not won by you alone. If you reject my word and renounce your faith, the enemy will tear you apart and leave you lying in the mud. You will go very far. You will bless many. Your family will also grow in wisdom and humility of heart. They will be prospered in everything but we need to walk together. Give me your hand. You are already prepared to rise to that spiritual level where the future is decided and lives change. As you listen closely today, a multitude of noble and grand endeavors awaits you. While you give me your attention, the groundwork for your future home is being carefully prepared, promising a secure place for you and those who follow. To each, I will grant a unique gift, a talent, a calling, nurturing the drive for learning and self-improvement. Beyond what you can see, 
beyond even what you can imagine, and far beyond your current beliefs. You and your family are not meant to live in spiritual poverty or emotional distress, nor to struggle through life's ups and downs, weighed down by heavy debts. Do not fear, my dear, for I urge you to listen to me. Start to dream. I will increase your faith and help you manage and wisely use the blessings that are coming your way. I will turn your trials into triumphs, your sadness into strength, and I will ease your pain, mending your heart with the soothing touch of my love. No matter where you are, caught up in the hustle of daily life and surrounded by crowds, take a moment to accept through faith. This gift I offer, peace for your soul and calm for your mind. I give you the strength to manage the overwhelming feelings that storm your thoughts, to face unsettling news without fear, and to regain the energy you thought was slipping away. My child, don't worry. Life goes on. This will pass. Your future is protected by a heavenly blessing safe from any foe aiming to bring you down. Truly, I hold all power. And it's my everlasting wish for you to experience the miracles I've prepared for you. For I am God, unfailing in my word, my purpose unwavering since the beginning of time. I've come to free you, to offer you eternal life, and to lead you on a path of righteousness. I am the way, the truth, and your life. I am your answer and your rescue. So I earnestly ask you with all the love I have, hold tight to my promises and turn away from the world's deceptions. It pleases me to see your trust in me flourish, to witness your disregard for the threats of the provocateurs who seek to rob you of your peace, to inundate your mind with anger and confusion, and to implant false ideas and erroneous sentiment within you. They desire to lead you astray, to incite myriad errors in your daily life, and to burden you with guilt, thus estranging you from the truth, from my love and from my presence. Be cognizant of their intentions. Know that you are beloved and I shall not suffer anyone to wrench you from the place where you now reside, enveloped in love and unparalleled affection. Though you have endured much solitude and dearth of tenderness in your life, I now embrace you comforting you with strength and divine encouragement. For I love you dearly, my child. I witnessed your fear, your distress, and I heard the cries of your heart, beseeching me urgently for aid. I fully grasp the situation you're in, and I recognize its significance. This challenge is too great for you to handle alone, and you might feel as though you've been left to fend for yourself, mistakenly thinking I'm angry with you or unwilling to help. But hear me clearly, you'll always need my help, no matter how well things seem to be going or how much you have. Stay vigilant, because the enemy is waiting to take advantage of any lapse in attention, aiming to break your spirit, disrupt your plans, and hurt you deeply. I'm here to support you with the current challenge you face. It breaks my heart to see you filled with sadness and distress. It's not what I want for you. I don't want you to suffer through this pain. Instead of fixating on what troubles you, hand them over to me. If you're haunted by thoughts of defeat, push them aside, for nothing is beyond reach for those who trust in me. If you start to feel hopeless, reject those feelings immediately. To avoid making a serious mistake, don't let discouragement find a home in you, because you are under the care of a God whose power knows no limits and whose blessings are infinite. Should the desire for life slip through your fingers, invoke your faith. You believe in a God omnipotent and sovereign who shall ignite within your heart the flame of divine love, instilling within you a wondrous desire to persevere. Cling tenaciously to the promises I offer you. Disregard the scorn of your adversaries, who daily assail you with reminders of your supposed unworthiness of life. You should no longer heed their voices. I desire for you to live and soon, very soon, you shall once again taste 
feel, and receive my blessings. Your circumstances shall improve, and the concerns that weigh heavily upon you shall soon be resolved. Therefore I beseech you, my dear child, if you've listened up to this point, know it's not by mere chance. Think about this. Do you feel you can keep moving forward no matter what holding on to your love for me? Your life is on the cusp of change. Your current struggles are about to see daylight. I'm stepping in in ways you can't imagine. Before you know it, a solution will present itself right before your eyes. Don't fall into the trap of those who cling to negativity or the words of those lost in their own spiritual darkness. If you're hearing or reading this message, it's because I've blessed you with the wisdom to understand. You've grown. You're prepared. The door is about to swing open. Understand I'm not an imaginary figure or a figment of wishful thinking. You know me. Truly know who I am. It's time to leave behind any skepticism of my promises. Whenever you face trials, I've been there to pull you through with my divine touch. I've wrapped you in my love breathed life into your days, and even when your past was filled with turmoil, once I stepped in, your present turned towards the better. Allow this fire in your heart, the dream that I have planted within you, to grow. It will become a tree that provides shade, abundance, and provision for you, and those you cherish with love. Hold on to the life I have given you. Fill yourself even more with joy. For there are many things I will soon do that will change your perspective. You will come to understand in a better way everything I have planned for you. Even when you've stumbled in the past, remember, I've always stood by your side. I've forgiven you, raised you up, and never left you to face defeat or solitude alone. Brighter days are ahead. Sorrow will fade away and your heart will overflow with joy due to the miracle that's about to unfold. Soon, you'll see it with your own ease. Now affirm your faith and dedication, and say to me, I believe. Just as I always tell you, I love you deeply. I have incredible plans for you. Give me your hand. Together, step by step, we will walk towards peace and happiness. The journey speed matters less than your resolve, and perseverance, keeping your faith calm and strong, not getting distracted, but keeping your focus on me and looking straight ahead. You will reach where you're meant to be. It's not as far off as it seems. Even if your mind and body sometimes convince you that time is dragging and patience is wearing thin, but you've matured. You no longer let fleeting feelings guide your actions. You understand that my wish is to shower blessings upon your family, making their path clear to confront any challenge fearlessly. Adversaries will be vanquished and hurdles will be surmounted. I do not promise an easy life, but I assure you that faith and strength will never elude you. Fill yourself with courage, knowing that your victory is assured. Receive my holy promises that bring healing to your body, health to your mind, strength to your heart. I want to break those chains of discouragement and depression, any despondency weighing heavily on your back and causing you to doubt my words. That deceitful friendship pulling you towards failure will vanish. Today a powerful miracle will occur if you commit to obeying me and cling to my love. But do not be like others who prefer to wallow in the filth and accept the lies of their destroyer. They chase after false promises. Seek material wealth, corrupt positions, manipulative control, and fleeting fun, thinking that my presence and power are with those who flaunt publicly everything. They do how they accumulate debt, what they wear, and what they eat. What a harmful falsehood. What a harsh trickery. Some turn away from my teachings dismiss who I am, and want nothing from the one who came to serve and sacrificed his life on the cross. Yet, you've welcomed me into your heart, and I aim to work wonders within you. Wrap your spirit in modesty, 
Shun the temptations of the deceiver. I'm here to help you. I'll grant you greater peace and insight so you won't tire of waiting, ensuring that grumbling and doubt don't spoil your speech, eroding your faith and joy. Now, from the depths of your heart, declare, my God, I believe in you. I trust you, and I wait patiently for my blessing. I assure you, your request will be fulfilled. Your faith in me has been steadfast. It's confident that all your prayers in Jesus' name will be met. I'm here to tell you of new seasons, of plentiful showers, of open skies, and of blessings so abundant they'll saturate every aspect of your life and home. You and your loved ones will overflow with peace and happiness. This is all within reach. For those who believe in me, who hold my teachings close to their heart and anticipate their blessings without growing weary or backing down, I urge you to stay alert. You need to remain unwavering and patient. Just as it takes nine months for life to emerge, a seed must land on fertile soil, break open and change before it can sprout and flourish. Your blessings are likewise precious and potent. It demands time and patience for everything to come together. For your benefit, I know you understand me and will not be discouraged. Keep your gaze on the horizon as you walk step by step. You will leave behind the place where you are now. Do not fear change. It is all for your good. I want you surrounded by people and resources that help you grow. If you walk with me, no one can overcome you, accuse you, or judge you, because I will defend you. Imagine if you could see with your spiritual eyes the heavenly forces surrounding you, if you could truly see my divine light shining on your path and watch as your challenges crumble before you. If you could understand every, everything happening around you, how the universe itself is aligning to support you. Soon I will reveal to you through dreams such splendors, giving you a glimpse of heaven right here on earth. I command the entire cosmos to bless you especially when I see a faith as pure and complete as yours. Your love for me, with all your heart and soul, moves me deeply. That's why I reach out to you every day with a fresh message. Even though your daily struggles may change, my love for you stays the same. Before you start your day, I want to tell you how much I love you. But more than that, I long to hear it from you. I want to listen. Tell me, beloved Jesus, I love you too. There is nothing you ask of me that my love cannot give you. I shall restore to you what is rightfully yours, your dignity, and the place you deserve. I offer you a better life if you surrender your heart and accept the healing and forgiveness bestowed by my sweet love. The promises I've made are already within you. They're etched in your heart. So, if you decide to believe, let it be with every ounce of your being. Don't mimic those who talk about my love yet lack true faith. I call you to complete freedom. This very night, my Holy Spirit will communicate with you, mending your heart and mind, liberating you from any remaining bonds. When you wake up, you'll be free like never before. Your joy won't depend on others' opinions anymore. You'll finally be your true self, my wise and insightful child, marked by kindness, steadfastness, and courage. Possessing a fervent, potent, and strong faith, cling to me in your darkest moments when people offend you and hurt your feelings, when everything around you darkens and you believe there is no reason to continue. You are mine, and you must aspire to greater things. Do not settle for a life spent weeping in a corner beneath a roof where you only suffer scorn. Remember my love for you is boundless. I support you, forgive you, and make you whole again. I promise a future brimming with potential, talents waiting to be unleashed, along with peace, joy, and health. Claim your rightful place with pride, for you are safeguarded, a cherished prince or princess forever under the watchful eye of your powerful Heavenly Father.
Declare with confidence, I trust in you. My beloved father, I am ready to embrace the miracle destined for me. Life is a precious gift, my dear daughter. Don't get lost in trivial pursuits, my son. Why exhaust yourself, my child? Why look for answers in a world so rife with uncertainties? Sin may have marred the essence of humanity, casting shadows and deceit to dim the brilliance of my truth, hardening hearts along the way. But don't be afraid. Resist the urge to seek fulfillment in the shadows of a world that tries to obscure your sight. Don't give in to despair or be carried away by the fleeting allure of this misguided and troubled world. Be brave in adversity. Maintain faith in your convictions. Let the truth within you be the compass for your decisions. Do not be deceived by fantasies and cheap doctrines. Let truth be the beacon that illuminates your path towards a purposeful and prosperous life. Be brave, son. Be brave, daughter. Let your inner light not just guide you, but also shine so brilliantly that it lights the way for those trapped in hopelessness and despair. Even when darkness seems overwhelming, remember, the light of truth and kindness cannot be put out. Nurture that light within you and watch as your path through life transforms into a journey marked by redemption, filled with peace and plenty. Life is a wondrous gift. Don't squander it on things that are shallow and soon pass away. Treat each day as a precious chance to love, to share, and to deepen your understanding of what truly matters. Don't be distracted by things that pull you from the real essence of life. Pursue love and togetherness with those around you. Take joy in giving to those in need. Know that the richest treasures are found in the love you share and receive. Realize the value of time. Embrace a heart full of thankfulness and recognize the fleeting moments of life. In doing so, you'll find that life becomes even more splendid when you choose to live with trust. I know life will present you with challenges and trials, seemingly impossible to overcome. Your faith will be tested, subjected to fire to be refined like gold. But fear not, for I assure you that throughout the process as you are being tested, I will be with you. Therefore, no matter the circumstances you are facing at this moment, no matter how dreadful the storm, you are not alone. Remain steadfast in my word and trust in my promises. Life's path can often feel daunting, but with me by your side, I'll turn it into a journey brimming with joy and remarkable triumphs. Pause your rush and quiet your despair amidst difficulties, for I have seen your future, and it is filled with victories and blessings, a plenty. Do not fear the injustices you might face. I will ensure justice prevails, always there to protect you from harm. I will take your hand, guiding you along beautiful trails of happiness and wealth. Endeavor with all your might. Plant seeds of love to harvest happiness, for the efforts you put forth today will bear fruit tomorrow. Protect your heart from the fleeting lures of this world. Stand firm in faith, even when those around you give way. Even if the road appears long and the journey arduous, I will be your refreshing haven, offering the waters of refreshment to soothe your thirst and bring you peace. March forward, unshaken by shadows or despair. Let hope flourish in your heart, knowing that overcoming these obstacles will make you stronger and more enlightened. Stand firm. Lay your burdens upon me. Be courageous in adversity. Maintain faith in your convictions and let the truth within you be the guiding compass of your decisions. Do not strive to understand the purpose for which you were created. I shall accomplish great feats through you. When you put your full trust in me, your journey through life will be filled with happiness, well-being, and abundance. Know that I'm always right there with you, watching over you, and lighting the way forward. I promise never to leave you behind, and I'm here to stay. 
I won't let go of your hand. I'm keeping a watchful eye on your loved ones too. Keep praying especially now. Times of sorrow are often when miracles are most ready to unfold. I don't wish for you to endure hardship because of what you're currently lacking. I will provide for you and fill your life with plenty. Be grateful for the blessings that come your way and wait with patience for my guidance. If you seek me out daily, you'll find my peace, carry calmness through your day, and feel rejuvenated when you return home. And as you step into your home, remember to give thanks to me for looking out for you. Pray for your food and do not forget to take time to converse with me. If I tell you it is for your good, I do not want you to feel pressured, but when you speak to me, your burdens dissipate, and I break the bonds that kept you captive to your thoughts. Fears and doubts are dispelled. Your life is filled with my wonderful presence, calming your emotions and dispelling storms. Being in my presence is a spiritual victory for you. Give me a few minutes and I will transform your character, removing all anxiety from your life. I will take away anger, shouts, fears, dangers, and imaginary scenarios that make your night heavier. I will liberate you from the same mistakes and deceitful lips that only bring discouragement and sorrow to your life. Today, I'm breaking every bond of darkness. My sacrifice on the cross wipes away your history, shatters your bonds, and ushers you into a triumphant life. Declare with all your heart that you trust in my words. I desire your happiness, your thriving, a wealth of joy fortifying your faith, bringing your family closer, turning your home into a sanctuary of tranquility and love. You've weathered many storms. You are precious, wise, and poised for greatness. You are akin to a sturdy tree, spreading its roots deep and bearing abundant fruit. I've readied you for the blessings that are on their way. I've imbued you with the spirit of love and strength to master your feelings. Remember, my love for you is so immense and steadfast that it envelops you in divine and flawless care. Your soul will find rest and your heart ease. Reach for my hand each morning. Cling to me when fatigue sets in. Talk to me, I'm listening. Share your needs, express your desires, and in confiding in me, you'll discover a peace that surpasses all earthly understanding. When you thank me, a warm wind will blow through your being. If you feel burdened, exhausted, sad, or discouraged, come and run into my arms. I will give you the rest you seek. I'm your best friend. Come and listen to my word. You will be fine in solitude. You will succeed. Holding on to my hand, and with love, you will never fail. Tell me you love me and put your trust in me. You know I'm here for you. This time you won't falter, and if you do stumble, I'll be there to pick you up. Be brave. The challenge isn't over yet. I plan to use you to spread blessings, and you'll carry out my will wherever you go. I've already shared how deeply I love you and everything I've done for you. Keep moving forward. This time, I'm with you at every step. I'll walk beside you. I've dispatched my angels to guard you against harm. When you call out to me, my hand will envelop you, and I'll shield you with my wings. In my presence, you'll find safety. I'll invigorate your spirit and infuse you with the bravery you need to win your battles. You won't be scared of the night's dangers. I'll be the light that guides you and your steadfast protector through hard times. My promises are true. Tell me you believe in me. You are precious. You are cherished more than anything. I have left seeds of victory in you. You just need to put on the armor of faith and boldly reap your fruits. Do not forget that I am with you in the name of my beloved son, Jesus. Get ready, because the miracle you've been praying for is about to happen. You're going to receive healing and blessings. Today, I'm here with words of love and hope because I want you to realize that you're always on my mind and in my heart. 
My love for you is constant and steadfast, like an unbreakable bond that's always there for you, even in the darkest and most challenging times. I am here to bring you comfort, peace, and strength. So today, listen closely, for I have something significant to share with you, the miracle you've been longing for, the one you've prayed about with such passion. It's going to occur. That divine sign you've hoped for will manifest in your life, because I, your Father, am about to reveal my power when you least expect it. I understand that you're navigating a world filled with uncertainty and challenges, and there are times you feel overwhelmed and disheartened. The weights you bear seem too heavy, and it might feel like your faith is faltering. But hear me clearly. You are never alone. I am with you at every step, never to leave your side, even in the bleakest moments. I've been with you from the start, and I will envelop you in my loving embrace when you feel your strength waning. At times, your heart may be filled with questions and doubts. You may wonder why you've had to face so many difficulties and challenges in your life. Why is it that you've had to endure so many calamities? There have even been moments when you've questioned my power over you. But I want you to know that everything has a purpose. Every trial you undergo not only brings forth a fierce struggle, but also presents an opportunity for you to grow and discover the strength that resides within you. Do not let adversity shake your faith. Do not allow the storms of life to snatch away your blessing. Always remember that I'm silently working in your favor to change your situation. To transform your pain and sorrow into joy and happiness. Though you may not see it now, know that I have a perfect plan for your life. Every experience, every tear shed, is weaving a beautiful tapestry that will soon be revealed before your eyes. When you least expect it, that miracle you yearn for will manifest in your life. It may come in a form you did not anticipate at an unexpected moment. But rest assured, it will come. You just need to trust in me and in my unconditional love. Believe that faith is your strongest tool against any hurdles you might encounter. Even when the odds seem stacked against you, hold on to your faith tightly. Don't get swallowed up by doubts or let fear disrupt your peace. I'm your God, the one who achieves the impossible. What's beyond human reach I can easily handle. Trust in me, and you'll witness the unbelievable. Mountains will shift, and pathways will clear right in front of you. Keep faith, my dear child and don't give in to despair. I understand that waiting can be tough, and impatience might grip you, urging for immediate outcomes. However, remember that this waiting period is shaping you, fortifying your faith, and setting the stage for the wonders that are yet to unfold. Don't give up hope. Focus on me, for I will never abandon you and am always acting on your behalf. So, my child, have faith because soon what you've prayed for will happen unexpectedly. Your miracle is on its way, and it will be even more magnificent than you've envisioned. Your health will bounce back. Your financial situation will improve. The aches in your heart will mend, and loneliness will be a thing of the past. Believe that I will make this happen, for I am your Father in heaven, meticulously planning every aspect of your life even if it's beyond your sight, touch, or comprehension. Once again, I tell you, do not lose your faith. Do not let impatience cloud your vision, nor let doubts or negative thoughts distance you from me. Let my word fill your mind. Allow the power of my promises to fill your life with hope and joy. Keep striving. Do not fear when you face the storms of life, for I am your rock and safe refuge. In moments of weakness, I will give you the strength you need. In times of confusion, I will guide you on the right path. And in moments of sadness, I will comfort you with my boundless love. Keep moving forward for a future filled with joy 
purpose and great blessings awaits you. I know that at this moment you are facing many difficulties that life has thrust upon you in a way you did not expect. But I want to remind you that amidst all these trials, I am always by your side. I will never abandon you, as many of your loved ones did, refusing to accompany you on the path of faith you have chosen. For sometimes, when things get tough, it's easy to lose faith, to think that all is lost. But know that I am greater than any problem. There is always a way out, an answer, even if it's not the one we expect. So, dear child, don't lose heart. Don't give in or bow your head in defeat because I've given you the power and bravery to tackle any obstacle. And I believe that with your trust in me, you'll get through this tough time you're facing now. Keep in mind that no situation is too difficult for me to handle when everything seems hopeless. I'm right here to take your hand and guide you towards victory, leading you out of the darkness, no matter how impossible it seems. Always hold on to hope. Keep your faith in me strong. I promise you, there's no challenge, no hardship, or obstacle too big for you to overcome. I have faith in you, my child. I know you'll make it through. Trust in my plan for your life and watch as my power works in your favor. Please, my child, never question my might, never doubt what I say. Even when things don't unfold as you hoped, Never lose faith in the purpose I have for you and my work in your life to accomplish it. Don't let your current situation define who you are. You're much stronger than you think, and you're destined to conquer this challenge. Don't stop striving. Don't give up on your dreams or what you've started. I'm with you, ready to support you in reaching all your objectives. Just have faith and witness my power transforming your life. Remember that I am always with you, no matter how dark the path you are traversing may be. I will never leave your side. There is nothing you can do to make me leave you, much less to make me stop loving you. Also, remember that you are not alone in this life. You have your family, friends, and loved ones whom I have placed before you to love and support you at all times. So, my dear one, continue to place your trust in me. Don't let fear or the unknown stop you in your tracks. Raise your head high, march forward with courage, and always look towards the horizon where hope glows. Even in the bleakest times, remember as long as you're here in this world, I am by your side, showering you with my love and bolstering you through every challenge. Don't be daunted by obstacles or trials, for you're more than victorious. You're capable of achieving anything you set your heart on because inside you is a formidable force, a resolve that outlasts any hardship. These are the tools I've given you to tackle whatever comes your way. Thus, when the shadows of doubt cast over you, recall that you are my child, brimming with potential, equipped with the fortitude to surmount any barrier. You possess the innate ability to uncover answers and forge paths forward on your journey. Always remember, you're never on your own. My love and might accompany you at every moment, lifting you when you falter and standing by you in trying times. For you are destined to be victorious. Trust that with me by your side, you can achieve all your dreams and goals. So do not give up. Persist with courage and determination. Your destiny is brimming with possibilities and promises waiting to be unveiled. Just keep your faith in me. Trust that my power will manifest in your life in ways you have yet to imagine, guiding you towards a future filled with success and accomplishments. Remember, you're stronger than you believe, capable of overcoming any challenge and accomplishing your goals. I'm right by your side, guiding each step you take towards a future brimming with blessings and triumphs. Keep pushing forward, my child. A future rich with joy, purpose, and incredible promises is on the horizon for you. Come closer to me, my dear son, my precious daughter, 
for I hold what you're searching for. My grace and favor are with you. I see the turmoil within your heart and hear the cries of your soul. I am familiar with your pains and the battles you endure. I also understand the thoughts that preoccupy you and bring you anxiety. I'm aware of your weariness and the stress that comes with each challenge you face daily. I know you inside and out, my cherished child, for nothing escapes my attention. Today I want you to understand that every tear you have cried and every pain you felt I have experienced alongside you. Not once have I left your side. I have always been there. There's never been a moment when I turned away from you because my love for you is endless and unwavering. Nothing you do can make my love for you stop. So, in times of sorrow, when you feel defeated or low, remember, I am forever with you. I promise never to abandon you, even in your darkest hours. Don't hesitate to open up to me, my child. I see the core of who you are. I know your strengths and victories, as well as your struggles and mistakes. I'm aware that there have been times when you felt far from me, wandering without direction. But hear this, even in those moments, my love for you hasn't faltered. Regardless of how often you drift away or let me down, I remain steadfastly by your side, always waiting for your heart to turn back to me. To grant you my infinite forgiveness, the peace and happiness you yearn for. Draw near to me, my child, draw near to my word. For within it, you will find solace and wisdom to confront your challenges. In it, you will discover the way out and the solution to every problem. You need only trust in me and I assure you through my grace, you will emerge victoriously from every adverse situation. Remember, my love for you doesn't depend on what you do or your achievements. My love is a gift freely bestowed by grace. So, step into my embrace, my dear child. I'm here, ready to help and welcome you with open arms. Let me mend the scars on your heart. Bring your heavy loads and worries to me. I'll carry them on your behalf. My strength can turn any pain into power and any grief into hope. Now take that step of faith, my dear child, and lay everything at my feet. I will gift you with the strength, bravery, and courage needed to push through the gloom and desolation weighing you down. Just hold my hand and let the glow of my presence chase away the shadows in your life. Don't be afraid to come to me, for in the midst of turmoil, I will be your safe haven. In times of distress, I will be your peace. When you feel alone, I'll keep you company. And in your moments of pain, I'll be your solace and strength. Have faith in me, my dear one. Believe in my word. I will be your protector and your unbreakable rock. Even when troubles seem insurmountable, I will raise you up and keep you dignified. In me, you'll find no cause for shame. For my light will brighten your path and guide you to the happiness and fulfillment you seek. Therefore, never hesitate to approach me in prayer, for I am always willing to listen to you and respond to your requests. Remember, whatever you ask of me in faith, knowing it is for your good and the good of others, I will grant it to you. So trust in me and in my plan for you, my beloved child, for my desire is for your well-being in every area of your life. On this day, do not hesitate to draw near to me. I will guide you with the light of my word, providing wisdom and direction for your life. Do not be discouraged if you falter or feel weak at times, for remember, in me, you will always find more than one opportunity and forgiveness for your faults. Trust in me and allow me to fill every corner of your heart with my love. On this special day, I declare you free from all affliction and depression that ravage your soul daily. Today, I break every chain of oppression that has only engendered feelings of despondency, sadness, and guilt upon you. 
Leave behind the past and move forward towards the promising future I've prepared for you. Look not back with guilt or remorse, nor heed the voice of the wicked. Remember, in my love, you will always find forgiveness and restoration for your soul. Starting today, walk, knowing you are my cherished child, the treasure I hold dear. I'm guiding you towards the life of abundance I've promised. Trust in me and see how my love empowers you, making you stronger than you could ever dream. At times, you're engulfed in a sea of duties, your days heavy with worldly worries. Take a moment today, step away from the daily grind, and listen closely to my message for you. I have something profound to share, something meant for the very core of who you are. Listen, let my words touch you softly, like a whisper soothing your spirit. Stay focused, listen not just with your ears, but with an open heart for what I'm about to reveal will bring you closer to the purpose and blessings I have in store for your life. Spare me a few moments, and I promise, you'll find a peace that eases your stress, no matter what surrounds you. My child, in this quiet time, let the gentle sound of my voice quiet the noise around you, and let truth fill your heart. Listen and let the purpose of my will manifest clearly, for you have a unique and special path to tread, a path of love, joy, and countless blessings. Simply cling to my words, and they will shape you into the prosperous and successful individual you're destined to become. Hence, it is imperative that you acquaint yourself with my will, to fathom from within what lies in my heart for you, for I desire to prosper you in all things. Cease listening to the world and harboring thoughts in your mind that speak otherwise. Disregard all notions seeking to sow seeds of poverty within you. It is time you acknowledge that the desire of my will is good, pleasing, and perfect. For I yearn to bless you in every aspect of your life, causing abundance to flow within you so that your dreams may be realized your endeavors flourish and your efforts rewarded abundantly. Every day will bring its own set of challenges. But within these challenges, remember, there are chances to grow stronger and more resilient. I promise to give you the courage to climb over any barrier and the steadfast confidence to weather any storm life throws your way. You'll see my grace and favor shining through every... Expect endless opportunities to advance and succeed. In your personal connections, you'll find yourself among true and loyal friends who will back you every step of the way. Your health will flourish, transforming your body into a beacon of strength and wellness. Peace will flood your thoughts, bringing balance to your feelings. Your soul will soar, drawing you closer to the divine and deepening your connection with me. Trust in my promises, for they are steadfast and true. Believe in them wholeheartedly, for they shall enrich your life. They shall be a balm, refreshing your soul. Fear not these words, for what I tell you today is real and genuine. Embrace my words with all your heart, and I shall reveal the path I have laid out for you, a path brimming with hope, purpose, and abundance. Remember, nothing that the world may say about you disqualifies you from deserving my love. Nor does how far you may have strayed, or how bleak your life may seem. My grace is more than enough to cover all your mistakes, and my mercy is always there to hold you close. There's nothing you can do that would make my love for you stop. It's unconditional. Today, dear child, walk knowing you are meant for something great in this world. Don't sell yourself short because of your age or doubts about your future. You are my creation made to reflect my image with a special role that only you can play. Your life has a divine plan, a mission uniquely yours. Whenever you feel tired or discouraged, remember these words and say them with conviction. 
I will infuse you with strength and lead you to the extraordinary life of blessings and greatness you are destined for. Keep pressing on, even when the winds are against you and it feels like everything's stacked up unfavorably. I'm always right there with you, cheering you on, giving you strength, and I'm ready to reward your hard work and commitment in big ways. I will bring your deepest wishes to life, and the doors you thought were closed will open wide right in front of you. Thank you, my cherished child, for taking the time to hear these words. Now march forward confidently. Don't be afraid of what lies ahead or get disheartened, because I am acting on your behalf. Even if the journey seems tough and the destination far off, know that my grace and might are greater than any challenge you might face. Continue on your path, my child. Proceed with faith and resolve, my dear daughter. And always remember, you are dearly loved and incredibly precious to me. Amen.